Turkey's unmanned fighter jet, Bayraktar Kizloma, completed its third test, a medium-altitude system identification test, a top official from the development company said. Selsa Bayraktar, chief technology officer, CTO, at Turkish drone king Baykar, shared the update on his Twitter account with video footage. Bayraktar Kizloma has successfully completed the medium-altitude system identification test. The statement read, the domestic plane reached an altitude of 20,000 feet during the test, Bayraktar said in the video. He said their testing of the aircraft would continue and plan to start mass production in early 2024. Bayraktar added that they are also preparing for the first flight of the Bayraktar TB3, the world's first drone capable of taking off and landing on a ship with a short runway. Turkish technology company, Bayraktar Technology successfully conducted the first test flight of their newest combat drone, Bayraktar Kizilomla. Unlike the previous Bayraktar drone, Kizilomla has the appearance of a sophisticated fighter jet. The first test flight of the Bayraktar Kizilomla was carried out at an airstrip in Turkey on December 14, 2022. This aircraft has a design like a fifth-generation fighter aircraft, but of course it is operated without a crew. The Bayraktar TB3 and Bayraktar Kizilomla Vertical Takeoff and Landing VTOL, drones will be exhibited at the major technology event Technofest, which will be held this year in Istanbul from April 27 to May 1, he added. Having completed its maiden flight in December last year, the fast drone fighter jet Kizilomla marks a significant expansion of capabilities for slow-moving reconnaissance and missile-carrying drones. The aircraft will be capable of taking off and landing on aircraft carriers with short runways, including Turkey's land-based amphibious assault ship, LHD, Anadolu. The autonomously maneuvering Kizilomla will be able to operate together with manned aircraft. The unmanned fighter jet is projected to be capable of carrying out many military actions, such as strategic strikes, close air support, CAS, missile attacks, suppression of enemy air defenses, SEAD and destruction of enemy air defenses. With a takeoff weight of 6 tons and a payload capacity of 1,500 kilograms, 3,300 pounds, the aircraft will be equipped with nationally developed ammunition. Kizilomla is set to conduct air-to-air -air combat with its aggressive maneuvers and advanced capabilities, which differentiate it from other unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, designed specifically to engage air targets with domestic air-to-air -air munitions. The platform is expected to have a significant impact on the battlefield. 